couldn't find a beach property that suited us, so we had to start looking at boats. So, through one thing and another, we uh, we looked at any number of boats. Um, never quite going the distance that we wanted to go, and um, it became a point where you wasted a lot of money repairing an older boat. Or fortunately, I walked into Clive one day, and here we are. We sit in a brand new boat. Heard of Silverton's, but I hadn't gone looking to buy a Silverton. No. It was just complete opportune that I ended up here. Clive set up a deal, for, um, I beg your pardon, Ralph set up a deal for us. Clive kind of brought the boat in and here we are today. Not really other than the fact we have a young granddaughter that lives with us and I have sons that have young children too who wanted to move around and have a look at a few bays and what else is available, you know, rather than just be at one beach place. Yes. Four hours out of Auckland and struggling to get there. I had heard of IPS um, I, I knew it was the latest technology. When the opportunity was owned this one with IPS, I jumped at the chance. The opportunity to own this one fitted into a price bracket, and what I was getting was a whole lot for the same money which I'd be paying more for out of Australia. Yeah. To be honest, Brummel wanted a gin palace. I wanted to go fishing. We had to come, we had to determine where we were at. This one here offered exceptional comfort with air conditioning and so forth right through. She was swung into that full length mirrors, really sold her. And uh, I had the opportunity to have something that I really wanted. And uh, it's not everybody gets a chance to own a new boat. And when I got the opportunity, I grabbed it. Master bedroom up the front there was a queen bed in it. And to the side is two berths and also the lounge can be. Down there, it has a head with uh, a vanity beside it. Very what she wants, real modern. <laughs> yeah. It also has a shower there, it, it can adapt to a shower. On the opposite side, we have another shower. Mm. Now, we've always had ski boats, that kind of thing, so that's it, isn't it? Mm. Yeah, this is the first large yeah. boat that we've been accepted to. Well, it was pretty simple, there was a pretty good team behind it. Um, I was informed it was on a certain ship, which I was, from the day it left America, I plotted it all the way to New Zealand to find it was on a different ship altogether. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. But uh, no, look, it was made easy and these guys did a fantastic job. Look, the moment I got here they were working on it, that night they were working on it. And to get in the water for us for this anniversary weekend.